Hello everyone, A Dog X here, back with Undertale Genocide. So we finished Waterfall, we beat Undyne, and now we've got to go through Hotland and the Core. And one thing that I did look up is that, whoops, sorry about that. Hotland and the, God damn it, mouse. Hotland and Core have the same share, the same uh, monster kill count. So. It's better that I go through uh, the core in order to, what's it called? Kill all the monsters. I know it's, oh, I can't go through that way? That's lame. So yeah, 40 left out of the entire area. And there's nobody really in Holland. We won't even be seeing Dr. Alphys here because Undyne had uh, Alphys abandon everyone. Oh, there you are, you ugly little creature. You've made quite a name for yourself. Such infamy! I'm impressed. Oh, yes. If you're looking for Alpha, she's not here. While you were busy doing your <coughs> thing, she was running around evacuating people to safety. Now they're in a sa in a place where you'll get never get to them. Deciding not to fight you. My, my, she really is the only smart one, isn't she? Oh? How sassy. You're just itching to get your hands on me, aren't you? Well, to oo ba ad This world needs stars more than it needs corpses. Toodles. So yeah, I've got to fight uh, Metaton still. But i got to fight ki or kill 40 monsters before I get to Metaton. Otherwise, I abandon the genocide run. And now it's this dark tone. Alright, well there's one. RIP! Alright, 39 more to go. And I will just show, like, me progressing, and we'll cut out, like, me moving around constantly. Like, just to get enemies. Alright, yeah, 39 left. I'm assuming all puzzles are done. Because of Flowey, that's my guess. Goodbye, Thunderplane. You survive? Don't get in your way. Girl, please, sir. Yeah, you're probably a girl. Plane, I guess. Ooh, that almost hit me. But, but I never got to. Jesus. Okay, so we gotta go this way, I think. Yeah. Well, let me cut to- well, nah, I'm not gonna cut as there's nothing to cut through. So I'm gonna see what's over this direction. I forget already. Like, is there something special going on here? Oh! Enemy! Pyro. Alright, one more attack. Okay, it's one of these. Ooh, I actually got through all of it. Nice! Sorry I was quiet that, but I had a focus. Alright. Okay, this is to get the frying pan. Okay, I didn't have this before. Yes. Alright. Items. Uh, use. Equip the burnt pan. Okay. Is there anything in that direction? There's nothing in that direction. Okay. So, we didn't get the frying pan last time. But we have it now. So, even though I won't be hitting twice, it should be stronger. Unless I remember there were lasers on, I thought I saw them. But whatever, that makes it easier. Don't have to deal with them. All lasers disabled. I like it. Okay. So, still nothing. Now, to see if we actually have to do the puzzles still. Nope, the puzzles are done. Okay. So, I guess we'll move on. Wait for it. There we go. We're good. Just keep moving. Oh, we gotta fight the guard sooner. You're here. So that means Undying. She's... Like, Undying! We'll avenge you! No, you won't. Just to make you cry. Oh, wow. Four times? Holy shit. Oh, two. I never told him. Well, too bad. And you never will. Not anymore, at least. I think it would attack four times. Alright, 
Level 13, nice. Alright, so seven more levels to go, because the cap is 20. And no Metaton. We won't be going through any of these stages. These annoying things. It's delightful. Alright, let's get that full HP. 35 left. I wonder if they counted towards the counter. I think so? I don't know. Yeah, I think they did. There, that works. Alright. So far, I haven't done any cutting. Oh, we can go straight to left 4, 3. Nice. We'll do that. And I'll probably be grinding within the core to get uh, the good stuff. Oh, yeah. Oh, we gotta fight Muffet. But I don't think she'll be a problem. I think I could take her out in one. Oh, wait, no. I can just go straight towards it. That's right. Don't have to deal with the puzzles. thing about Genocide is, even though it's supposed to be more difficult to play, it's a lot faster. Okay, so yeah. Still 35 left. It's time to fight Muffet. <laughs> Did you hear what she said? They said a human wearing a striped shirt will come through. I heard that they hate spiders. I heard that they love to stomp on them. I heard that they like to tear their legs off. It's time to fight you, Muffet. I heard. That they have some awful taste. What a shame. A human comes through and they aren't even fit to be eaten. Oh well. Rotten ingredients can always be discarded. And you're gone. Right away. Goodbye, spider. And the spider brings a little flower as an offering to their dead master. Run, spider, or else you die too. Thank you for the experience, or the execution points, rather. All right, so I pa also apologies if I sound far away. I'm trying to not be too loud again. So we don't anyway. So we get to skip that. What this? Where this lead me to? Oh, the R3. All right, so we'll already be in the core. Oh, well, not yet. We're in the resort. 34 left, okay. Use the box, yes. Uh, I do not need, I guess, uh, monster candy. Might as well get that stuff. I'm gonna put the torn notebook there. Actually, no, put the crab apple back. Put the monster candy back. Now, I have plenty of gold, and I could buy here. Why do I always get the freaks? Alright, so I'm definitely gonna want that. Want that. Let's see, heals 40. There we go! Oh, whoops. Okay. Now, we have all the items that we need, like the good stuff. So we'll be ready to fight Metaton. Now, I can go through the elevator right away. It'll already be enabled. I know about that, but... Let's see. Nothing. So, yeah. I want to get go through the core just to find the monsters. And I'll probably not show you guys. So, yeah. I'll skip to when I get some fights. Alright, so the bridge still uh, enables the fights. So that's good. That's doing a decent amount of damage. Whoa, hello. Okay, hello. Frog it. Calm down. Calm down, Frog it. Goodbye. I was about to say if he lived. More fights. Let's do this. Give me all the enemies. That was poorly timed. 90 damage? Dang it. Not enough. Okay, yeah. Okay, hello. Bad, that was horrible. Okay, good thing I'm trying to take on night the night night now. 
Ow! Prick. Goodbye. Alright, now it'll be easier. There we go. Say farewell. Just die already. Easy dodgings, easy dodgings. You can't touch me now. Got your little buddy to help you. Farewell. Dang, I need to hurry up and reach level, uh, what's it called? 20, 19. At least. Okay, good. Stigmatism. Still alive, really? Ow! Okay, so I should probably take out Whimsicott, or Whimsalot first. Okay, good. That's one enemy down. I'll take out Final Froggit next. It's, I think I'll be able to take him out in one hit. Or not. Never mind. I guess I needed to do exactly 100 damage to him. Ow. Alright, Frog is down. Now it's just you. Ow. Oh yeah, one thing I will say is that we don't go through the true lab uh, in Genocide. So the genocide is definitely going to be a lot shorter now. I'm going to go heal up real quick. Alright, so I saw that I have only 27 left to kill. This will make it where I have 26 left. And I'm going to be just running back and forth in this on this bridge in order to uh, do that. 26 left. Okay, yeah. Yep, 26 left, so I'm just gonna start trying to grind, so I'll see ya whenever. Alright, two more enemies is good. Did that take him out? That should take him out, good. Alright. Ow! You little prickhead. Dang it! Die already! Ooh, critical hit, nice. I like. And I leveled up, good. Alright, two more enemies right away. The encounter rate seems to be a lot more than uh, normal. Or than the other areas, because I'm finding them pretty quickly. I'm still going to cut that stuff out as unnecessary. So yeah, that's good. That didn't take him out. Nope. Alright. This is good, this is good. Ow, you little prickhead. Goodbye. Thank you. Alright, two more. After these guys, it'll make it, uh, 20 left. So we're actually getting through the, the core a lot faster. Hotland in the core. Yeah, this is going to be a lot shorter than I originally planned. I didn't think it would be so short compared to Pacifist. But then again, it makes sense. I'll have to go through much more areas in order to, uh, what's it called? Get through the game. Alright, not Night Night again. This is going to be a pain. Right, yeah, it's definitely better I take out the Night first than uh, Magic. Right, one more turn. Just got to survive for one final turn and we're good. Okay, good. The Night is down. The Magician is next. And the Magician is easy. Take two turns to take him out, though. Okay, I gotta get a better uh, turn next time, otherwise I'm gonna take a third, which I don't want. Dang, these dodges are on point. That was... Oh, that was good enough. All right, the easy ones. Good, good, good. We'll take out Whimsalot first. And right, now we just gotta work with him, and then we'll be uh. We'll be alright. Ow. And then I'm going to heal again. Because piss off. Yep, one more turn. We're good. I keep saying the same things over and over and over again. And I hate it. Just die. Another two. I would prefer, you know, it would be a challenge. I'd rather get the set of three. Because that would make it so much quicker. I take out three enemies in one area, and we're and it's all good. Sadly not. You know, before the final boss, I'm supposed to be level 19, but it doesn't look that way. 
Probably because I haven't fought all the powerful enemies. I've been fighting a lot of weak ones. All right, another set of two. Same set. Okay, so it's literally me doing the same fights over and over correctly, but because it's genocide, I gotta show all the fights. So yeah, apologies that if that gets boring. You can skip towards the main story stuff. Whatever. You know, it's funny. I might actually be able to uh, get all of Hotland and Core in one episode. Nice. All right. After these guys, I will have what's it called? Ten enemies left. Ah, already hit me. Jeez. Oh yeah, I am healing after this fight. This is not looking good. All right, magic's down already. I decided to get rid of him this time because it's uh, quicker and I have less turns to deal with two enemies. Ooh, barely got that. But of course, it's always going to take, it's called, three turns to take out the Night Knight. Okay, one more, one more. Dodge these meteors. Ooh, nice. Good dodging on my end, I'll take it. Excellent. Level 3. Or 15, I'm stupid. Alright, we got a set of 3 now. That's good. Beautiful. Take them out quickly. This will get me at 7 left. So that's nice. It's very nice. I appreciate it. Okay, he's done. Now I got this guy to worry about. Now if I want to take him out in one turn, I've got to get the lucky crit. And that's timing everything right. That, that was good enough. Excellent. Another set of three. Nice. I'll take it. Gets things done quicker. So what would have been three encounters to get six done, it only took me two. So I appreciate it a lot. See if we can do it again like we did last time and get the, uh, what's it called, ow, the right attacks. No, I did not. Dang it. Okay, so I'm assuming his HP is 120, because that's the lowest we killed him at. Whatever. We got it done anyway. Only one? What the hell? Well, either way, this will take him down to, uh, take the counter down to three more. Dang it, why did I only get one? That's lame. Why couldn't I have gotten two at least? What the heck? It's stupid. Ow! Uh, whatever. At least we still got progress. Okay, now we've got two again. So, after that, we'll only have one more to kill. And then everything's good, we can move on into the Metaton fight. Gotcha! Ooh, beautiful, beautiful. Alright, we got two, even though we only need one, but it's extra experience that I'll take any time. So thank you, game. This will be the last fight that we need to do before Metaton. I hope Metaton gives me enough experience to, uh, what's it called? Get to level 19, because that's what I'll definitely need. Ow. Piss off. Beautiful. And that's it. Everyone is gone. Now, we don't have to worry about that anymore, but I didn't get the high enough level that I would have liked. Yeah, it says level 12, but whatever, I'm current. Alright, let's move on to the new Metaton battle. My, my. So you finally arrived. After our first meeting, I realized something ghastly. You're not just a threat to monsters, but humanity as well. Oh my, that's an issue. You see, I can't be a star without an audience, and besides, there are some people I want to protect. <laughs> Eager as always, eh? But don't touch that dial, there's something you haven't accounted for. As any true fan would know, 
I was first created as a human eradication robot. It was only after becoming a star that I was given a more... photogenic body. However, those original functions have never been fully removed. Come any closer, and I'll be forced to show you. My true form! Fine then! Ready? It's showtime! Now, I've never done this fight before. I've never seen this fight before. Metaton Neo, no idea how it works, but we're gonna try. Okay. G Guess you don't want to join my fan club? You're joking, right? That... That... Was Metaton Neo. That was disappointing! See, I've seen boss fights of Genocide on YouTube videos, but... Metaton Neo and uh, Undying the Undying are the fights I haven't seen. I was not disappointed with the intensity of the Undying fight. Metaton Neo? So disappointing. <sighs> I didn't think I could actually fit all of the core in the Hotland into one episode. But I'll take it. I mean, it's less things to edit. Less videos, though. Sure, some people are like, I want to see more Undertale, but... Eh. The sooner Genocide gets done, the better. Holy crap, I forgot how long this elevator is. Now, I'm supposed to be... Again, level 19 by the, uh... What's it called? Final boss. But... Oh, brother. It is in use. I'm supposed to be level 19 by the final boss, so I don't know why I'm not level 19. I've always seen people at level 19 by the time they face the final boss. So I'm confused as to why I'm not. Is it because I, uh, what's it called? Didn't, what's the word I'm looking for? Fight only the strong ones? Perhaps that's my fault? So this is actually gonna be a lot tougher. Oh, there's a box here. Yeah, but, okay. So, I don't, Actually, well, since I'm in here, I don't need the... Well, Monster Candy gives me less, actually. So first we'll use that. Alright, now we'll give me the Butterscotch Pie. Uh... Yeah, this is really it. This is the best items I got. I should go back and uh, get some new ones, but I'll finish this episode first before I go to the actual area. But I still gotta do the same stuff. There's a heart-shaped locket inside the box. Will you take it? Take. Oh, frick's sake. Hang on. Okay. Now we'll take the locket. Equip the locket. Right where it belongs. Now I gotta change something else real quick. Okay. Knife inside the box. Will you take it? You got the real knife. So yeah, this weapon changed. About time. Okay, so now I have a real knife. I have got to store this again in my uh, dimensional box. Okay, I'll just eat the crab apple just because. Oh yeah, I didn't. Yeah, I equipped it. Never mind. Uh, we'll take another crab apple out and put the burnt pan in. And now we'll take another crab apple. We'll be all set. So now I gotta go get the keys to, uh, unlock the area. Where the key at? Okay, key right- oh. Howdy, Chara. You finally made it home. Remember when we used to play here? <laughs> Boy, today's gonna be just as fun. What the hell are you doing here, Flowey? Also, notice I'm not as high-pitched for Flowey, because that kind of put a strain on my voice, so I'm not doing that anymore. Sure, people will be like, yay! I remember when I first woke up here in the garden. I was so scared. I couldn't feel my arms or legs. My entire body had turned into a flower. Mom! Dad! Somebody help me! I called out. But nobody came. Okay, I did just notice that I'm already level 19. I guess it forced me up to it. So I guess that's nice. Flowey, please! Eventually, the king found me crying in the garden. I explained what had happened to him. Then he held me, Chara. 
He held me with tears in his eyes, saying, There, there, everything is going to be alright. He was so emotional. But, for some reason, I didn't feel anything at all. So, so Flower's replacing the other monsters. Okay. Forgot about that. I looked that up, but I forgot about that. Whatever. I unlocked the chain. Okay, so now I'm no longer Frisk at all. This is not Frisk, no matter what. It's all Chara. I soon realized I didn't feel anything about anyone. My compassion had disappeared. And believe me, it's not like I wasn't trying. I wasted weeks with that stupid king, vainly hoping that I would feel something. But it became too much for me. I ran away from home. Eventually, I reached the ruins. Inside, I found her, Chara. I thought of all people, she could make me feel whole again. She failed. Haha. <laughs> Jeez. So we're learning more about Flowey's past. I realized those two were useless. I became despondent. I just wanted to love someone. I just wanted to care about someone. Chara, you might not believe this, but I decided it wasn't worth living anymore. Not in a world without love. Not in a world without you. So, I decided to follow in your footsteps. I would erase myself from existence. And you know what? I succeeded. Well then, shit's getting dark. But as I left this mortal coil, I started to feel apprehensive. If you don't have a soul, what happens when you... Something primal started to burn inside me. No, I thought. I don't want to die. Then I woke up. Like it was all just a bad dream. I was back at the garden. Back at my save point. See? That's what we're getting at. Interested, I decided to experiment. Again and again, I brought myself to the edge of death. At any point, I could have let this world continue on without me. But as long as I was determined to live, I could go back. Amazing, isn't it, Jara? I was amazed, too. So yeah, Flower used to have the power of reset before we did. At first, I used my powers for good. I became friends with everyone. I solved all their problems flawlessly. Their companionship was amusing. For a while, as time repeated, people proved themselves predictable. What would this person say if I gave them this? What would they do if I said this to them? Once you know the answer, that's it. That's all they are. So Flowey got bored and became the way he was because of said, th said thing. It all started because I was curious. Curious what would happen if I killed them. I don't like this, I told myself. I'm just doing this because I have to know what happens. <laughs> what an excuse. You of all people must know how liberating it is to act this way. At least we're better than those sickles that stand around and watch what happens. Those pathetic people w that want to see it, but are too weak to do it themselves. I bet someone like that's watching right now, aren't they? Yeah, Flowey is literally talking about you guys watching the video. Sickos. Nowadays, even that's grown tiring. You understand, Chara. I've done everything this world has to offer. I've read every book. I've burned every book. I've won every game. I've lost every game. I've appeased everyone. I've killed everyone. Sets of numbers, lines of dialogue, I've seen them all. But you, you're different. I never could predict you, Chara. Well, no, duh. I'm interrupted all timelines. When I saw you in the ruins, I didn't recognize you. I thought I could frighten you, then steal your soul. I failed. And when I, tr and when I tried to load my save file, it didn't work. Chara, your determination. Somehow, it's even greater than mine. See? That's why I have the power and Flowey doesn't anymore. I just have one question for you, Chara. How did you get back to the ruins from here? Wait, I know. She must have taken you when she left, and decided to give you a proper burial rather than... hanging out in the basement forever. But, why then? What made you wake up? Did you hear me calling you? Jeez. It doesn't matter now. I'm so tired of this, Chara. I'm tired of all these people. I'm tired of all these places. I'm tired of being a flower. Chara, there's just one thing left I want to do. Let's finish what we started. Let's free everyone. Then, 
Let's see what humanity is really like. That, despite it all, this world is still kill or be killed. Oh, Flowey. Then, well, I had been entertaining a few ways to use that power. <laughs> but seeing you here changed my mind. Chara, I think if you're around, just living in the surface world doesn't seem so bad. Say that now, Flowey. We don't need... We don't even need to leave to get them this time. The king has six of them locked away. I've tried hundreds of ways to get him to show me them, but he just won't. Char, I know he'll do it for you. Oh, really? After all I've done? Why am I telling you all this? Char, I said it before. Even after all this time, you're still the only one that understands me. You won't give me any worthless pity. Eh, I guess Char does. Creatures like us wouldn't hesitate to kill each other if we got in each other's way. So that's... so that's... why... <laughs> What's this feeling? Why am I shaking? Hey, Jara? No hard feelings about back then, right? And hey, what are you doing? B back off! So Chara was actually trying to kill Flowey, and still is. I, I've changed my mind about all this. This isn't a good idea anymore. You, you should go back, Chara. This place is fine the way it is. Just stop making that creepy face. This isn't funny. You've got a sick sense of humor. Well, it's Chara we're talking about. All right, we made it. All right, I'm going to stop here. I might actually cut a uh, few things into one, depending on what happened, you'll see. Because I forgot about this, I didn't think it would take that long. So I hope you guys enjoyed, I will see you all in the next video. Later.